Because the Diddy, the Diddy, Diddy, Diddy. Oh! Diddy done turned over tapes. Allegedly, with the Carters, in some freak out. And the, and, and the, and the, and the Beyonce, high on the cocaine. And the tapes had jizz all over it. Girl, this situation with Diddy just blew up in the most insane way possible because inside sources are revealing that Beyonce and Jennifer Lopez have loads of questions to answer from the feds because Diddy not only spilled the tea on Jennifer Lopez and her involvement in helping him smuggle arms, he also snitched on Beyonce for helping his traffic underage kids and participating in freak-offs alongside Jay-Z with them. What is this tea and what the hell is happening in Hollywood? First of all, let me start by saying that Diddy's Rico's situation is going to change the dynamics of Hollywood. And believe me when I say lots of celebrities are going to go down with him because the whole situation looks like something out of a Netflix crime series. And with each day passing, we hear about involvement of another celebrity and the whole thing looks scary. For those who have not been following this story, let me give you a refresher. So Diddy has been the subject of numerous civil lawsuits over the past few months with the latest filed by music producer Lil Rod Jones. But then the Lil Rod Jones lawsuit turned out to be damaging because not only did he expose Diddy for running a trafficking ring, but he also claimed that he had evidence to back his claim, coupled with video evidence Diddy had. So a few weeks after the lawsuit dropped, the feds stopped Diddy at the airport search at him and arrested his drug mule. At the same time, Homeland Security simultaneously raided his Los Angeles and Miami mansion for pieces of evidence to support what they have in the Diddy investigations. Homeland Security got what they wanted as they were pictured leaving Diddy's homes with documents and gadgets. But then inside sources revealed that Homeland Security's raid caught Diddy unaware because it was a civil lawsuit and he never expected the feds to raid his home. And when they raided his home, they had their hands on the storage that had the videos Lil Rod Jones' lawsuit was talking about. Sources at Homeland Security revealed that with the investigations, they've done coupled with the evidence they found at his home. Diddy would be looking at a long time behind bars because the video evidence gotten at his home nailed him and his accomplices. But one thing came as a surprise to us. Sources at Homeland Security revealed they were not limiting the investigations to the lawsuit as they were expanding their investigations to over two decades and are looking to solve unresolved cases that were linked to him. The source revealed that Diddy knew he was done and in a bid to get a lighter sentence he began snitching on everyone. The source claimed Diddy handed over to the feds the names of everyone in his smuggling ring. And while everyone on the list was under 24 hours surveillance, the reason the names on the people on the list has not gone public is that they were tying them to the cases because they don't want to leave any room for errors. So a few days ago, news went around that Diddy named Jay-Z as one of his accomplices. And while investigations are ongoing, there's a high likelihood that Jay-Z could be the next target for a raid on his home. Reports suggest that Jay-Z not only had ties to Diddy's trafficking ring, but is also under scrutiny regarding the sudden death of Kathy White, rumored to be his mistress. Jay-Z being investigated didn't come as a shock as he has been friends with Diddy for over two decades. And y'all know what they say about birds of the same feather. Yeah, they gonna flock together. But a few hours ago, we got the shocking news that not only were Beyonce and Jennifer Lopez linked with Diddy's case, but part of the gadgets that Homeland Security recovered from Diddy's home contained a video of Jay-Z and Beyonce participating in freak-offs with Diddy recording the whole incident. I must admit, I've heard some wild stories about Hollywood, but this one takes the cake. The fact that Jay-Z and Beyonce, the epitome of Hollywood's power couple, are allegedly involved in wild parties with Diddy is shocking. Jaguar Wright, who over the years has been trying to expose Jay-Z and Diddy confirm the story she said, because the Diddy the Diddy, Diddy, Diddy. Oh. Diddy done turned over tapes. Allegedly, with the Carters, in some freak out. And the, and, and the, ba and the Beyonce, high on the cocaine. And the tapes had jizz all over it. 
However, there was more shocking news to follow. Beyonce and Jennifer Lopez were also implicated in Diddy's trafficking ring. It was disclosed that Jennifer Lopez's connection to the 1999 New York club shooting was under scrutiny. Following the incident, Diddy, Shine, and Jennifer Lopez were arrested. However, hours later, charges against Jennifer Lopez and Diddy were dropped when Shine confessed to smuggling the gun into the club and firing the shots. But then Diddy confessed to the crime and revealed Jennifer Lopez helped smuggle the gun into the club, which makes her an accomplice. But it gets crazier when you hear Beyonce was part of Diddy's sexual trafficking ring. The sources revealed that not only did Jay-Z and Beyonce participate in freak-off parties, where minors with lots of minors, but the source also revealed that Diddy confessed to Beyonce recruiting underage girls that were groomed and trafficked. The source revealed that Diddy intentionally ratted Beyonce and Jay-Z because he felt disappointed in them. He revealed that while he was close to the Carters, they never said any word or did anything when he was receiving multiple lawsuits while he knew Jay-Z had friends in the media that could either spin the stories or give him some soft landing, but rather they decided to play mute. Now that the feds were involved, he was not going down alone. So everybody got to pay for their crimes. News of Beyonce and Jennifer Lopez's involvement in Diddy's Rico case has sent the internet into a frenzy and fans left comments saying maybe the public will finally stop idolizing these people i've always thought jay-z and beyonce's relationship was for business there is absolutely no chemistry to me not even after three children i think she caught feelings and it changed somewhat but not for him joe is guilty that's for sure her career was bought for her by diddy over keeping silence of his crimes so do you think beyonce and jennifer lopez are really involved in Diddy's dirty crimes? Or do you think there's more to the story than what we are being told? Let me know what you think in the comments. Then check out this next video. 